And I'm not trying to make you sound stupid here, but laughter is not an action. So let's think about it. What, what's the. Nigga, that just proves my point. Men are better and suited for enduring extreme laborious work, therefore making them more wait for it. Wait for it. Expendable, you dumb, retard, half-breed nigger, snow monkey. You need the white man to cure you. How in the fuck does that make men more expendable? It, it only makes men more valuable. If you're saying men are better at something, that makes men more fucking valuable. That's why women are uh, like have for the longest time being second class citizens. That's why for the longest time women have had no rights. That's why men always get the inheritance. Men always get to eat first. Boys are fucking treated better. They're the ones that go to school, get an education. They're the ones that own property. It's because men are fucking worth more, at least in traditional societies. So how the fuck are men more expendable when men are better at everything and they're fucking worth more and they're treated better? That makes no fucking sense. This is just some like retarded, bizarre, stupid incel shit. I, I think a lot of dudes have just become super, super fucking insecure the, and they suck at getting girls. Women don't fucking like them because they're fucking annoying, weaselly assholes and they don't even realize it. They suck at everything. They suck at school. They suck at work. They suck at like just everything. And then they get this fucking idea in their head. Oh, society's geared towards women. We care about women more. Nobody cares about women more. No one's cared about women more. Like, again, men have had such a huge fucking advantage for so fucking long. Again, boys are the ones that get the inheritance. Boys are the ones that fucking go to school. They're the ones that get property, get money, get everything. And then, like, now we just have a lot of fucking incels who are trying to make this fucking excuse that women have some sort of fucking advantage and they're valued more when they're just not. Um, if anything, things have just at least equalized, but where the fuck do you get the idea that women are worth more because men are more valuable for labor? That makes no fucking sense. Thanks for the donation, Kid Boo. Destiny, you donated 224. What compels you to say, stay in Canada? You're pretty well off, so you're getting taxed in the ass. I'm not. Uh, Canada has a much better tax system than the U.S. At least for my job. You aren't benefiting from the social welfare. I am. Um, I get free healthcare. And I need a lot of healthcare with my mental issues. And you have to pay a shit ton of cost of living. Cost of living is a little bit higher, but I'd end up losing. Uh, I'd end up losing out on um, healthcare, healthcare costs. And I'd end up losing out on taxes. I'd have to pay more taxes if I moved to the States. Uh, that's that's an absolute fact. I've looked into it. So I'd have less money if I moved to the US. React to this. Let me see. I'm not reacting to Madagascar. It's copyrighted, so. Thanks for the donation, though, Destiny. Um, green muffin donated two dollars. At least some animals are treated good in India. Let me see. <laughs> Fucking music is annoying as shit. Well, I'm glad he's being nice to the cows. Those are some nice cows. That cow likes the banana. Wow. Wow. Those are pretty cows. Those are sweet cows. Oh my god. I really like cows. Cows are awesome. Cows are friends. And that is cows are everywhere in India. Like here we are on the beach and just cows. 
What I like about these cows is often the, the dogs in the morning, I'll come out and the dogs are playing with the cows, which is kind of cool. I've heard that, oh, hello. I, oh, okay, okay, are we moving? Hello, okay. I've heard that the cows, there's a bill of rights for the cows in India. Hmm. Oh, we're all in the mood now. Yeah, they look underweight. They really need to eat more. I've made them a little uncomfortable with my vlogs. You know, not everyone's comfortable with my vlogs. <laughs> oh, meat industry. Cows are Those are really beautiful cows. Would you ever pet a wild cow? Of course I would. Thanks for the donation, Green Muffin. Nigga, do I really got a dick smack you with a dictionary? Look up what the word expendable, you monkey. Men can impregnate multiple women while women can only get pregnant once. Therefore from a survival perspective that makes men more expendable. Dipshit. Um... That's one way of looking at it. Uh, another way of looking at it is... Men, again are able to do more work, they're able to be more productive, they're able to protect whereas women can't, and therefore a male child or a male in society is ha carries more value with it. So losing a male uh, is going to be a bigger loss than losing a female. And since a female can only have one child at a time typically, um, losing a, a male child or a male citizen, uh, is again, considered a bigger loss than losing a single female. Um, so I, I don't know why you're talking about just the ability to breed specifically. Again, if yeah, you're a fucking idiot. Thanks for the donation, Kid Boo. How does one unshit their pants? Who do I need to contact? Unshit the pants. Uh, maybe call your mom. I think she'd probably know. Thanks for the donation, Elmo. Jasmine says it's called diapers. <laughs> She's a woman, so she'd know. Emotion. Um... 